Welcome to Synthetic Oil Protection. I'm your host, Steven, and today is another exciting AMS oil engine flush. We're also doing the Zero W40 Signature Series, 100% synthetic, the best of both worlds, cold flow protection and high heat film strength. And we're with our good man, Adashir, right? Ishar. Ishar, that's it. And he has the beautiful 2019 C7 Z06 Stingray. And this is the, the first year back. They brought the Stingray back and it's exciting as heck. And this is our first one on the channel. So the first thing we're gonna do is give this engine flush to Ashir, Ashar. And this is gonna clean oil cooler ports, sticky valves, all the carbon around the rings. And uh, if it has a turbo, also turbo coking, which a lot of turbos get, this is supercharged, but it can also get that buildup. So we're giving that to you and you're gonna dump it in right now. Go ahead and pop that lid and open that up. You'll see the seal on there. And you're gonna open your oil, which is over here, it's okay. And I got you a funnel right here. So we got our Zero W40, which is our perfect between racing and that. And now the detergent goes in and bring it up a little bit, let them see what it looks like, yep. So it's this very thin detergent. And what it does is it actually thins out the oil and helps dissolve all that buildup around the timing chain, oil cooler ports around the rings. And uh, you actually idle the motor for about 15 minutes. So the motor's already nice and hot. So we're gonna idle her for 15 minutes. In the meantime, we're also gonna run a fuel additive, which we're gonna show you right now. If you're new to the channel, definitely subscribe, tap that notification bell. That way you can come back and watch lots of more liquid gold videos. We're protecting your vehicle so your vehicle runs longer and stronger. And now it's time for our PI Performance Improver Gasoline Additive. This is a uh, proprietary cleaner, very heavy detergent, cleans the valves, injectors, all the carbon deposits inside the combustion chamber. And you put this in every 4,000 miles and you got the honors. And all he's gonna do is pop this lid. You push in, taco the little flap and peel. Yep, taco, push in the middle, yep. And he's got it. And now you shove in, take a look. And you're gonna see this is the double gas cap compatible. So shove all the way in and penetrate both flaps. So you got a deeper flap, which is the seal, and then you got the outside dust cap and you need to have a nozzle long enough to get through both of them. Like we say in the channel, if you want your car to run longer and stay longer, you're gonna wanna put this stuff in your car. It's gonna really clean it up, make a lot more horsepower so you can close it. And now all we do is idle her for 15 minutes so you can start her up. We're good to start her up. And you'll get to hear what she sounds like. I got it. Before what she sounds like. Here is the after. All right, we got two drain bolts, which we're gonna show you right now. And it's a 15 millimeter socket. And you gotta watch the one because the one right here, this one's easy to get to, but the one over there is right by this oil cooler. And that one's so difficult to get to, it's unbelievable. You need an open-ended wrench, which I recommend a box wrench. 
and uh, definitely use that. It's right by that oil cooler. So here we're gonna go back to the camera guy. You take that. All right, and here we go. We're gonna drain her down. We're gonna start with the one to the side, and then we're gonna go to this one over here. On the count of three, a one, a two, we're gonna see the liquid charcoal flow. And a, the, this thing threads for miles. And a, the, wow, that's the longest bolt ever. The re, there's that one. And now we're going to set down that big bolt thing so long and now we're going to crack our other one we'll get that draining as we go and then we're going to be cracking our filter a one a two and a the theory and there she blows so we let her drain down for about five ten minutes we come back bolt her up and we're good to go all right we got our oil filter wrench we just cracked her loose it's nice to have a good oil filter wrench and now we just go by hand now easy as pie and we just let her drain down Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Off with the old, and now we're on with the new. It's that time to go ahead and prime our oil filter. <clears throat> what we got here is our EA15K50. This is our oil filter. It's good for 15,000 miles of severe service and 99% uh, efficiency at 20 microns. So what that's gonna do, it's gonna catch all these little contaminants in suspension which the AMS Oil Signature Series is going to keep that in suspension for up to 25,000 miles, one year, or 700 idling hours. You heard it right. And this stuff right here is what we call in the channel the liquid gold. So we're going to crack our bottle, and we're going to prime our nice, fresh virgin filter. Now, if you're driving in super high, dusty conditions, I recommend changing your filter every 10,000 miles, and that way you don't have all that particle in the air which out here it's really dusty so now we're going to go ahead and prime her up and we just pour in the old liquid gold so pure so clean and we say almost untouchable and we just pour it until it boobles out of the top and what we say in the channel if it ain't fun it ain't messy and if it ain't messy it ain't fun that's why the wetter the better we come in with two finger this sucker will handle two finger get our threads just watch you don't cut yourself sometimes it's a little sharp get your rubbers and now it's time to go ahead and thread her on. All right, it's that time to put in the liquid gold. He's got the honors. He's putting in the very first quart. And this is the 0 W20 Amsoil, or 0 W40 Amsoil Signature Series. Now this is the best of both worlds. You got your super cold flow protection at negative probably 50 degrees Fahrenheit, it still flows. And then the other thing you got is the high heat film strength. It doesn't thin out, doesn't uh, basically split the molecules apart. And um, just so pure, so clean. I almost say it's untouchable, but it is. You can touch it. If you stick your finger, you can feel it. It's that smooth and slippery. And we call this the liquid gold on the channel. And we actually did a cold flow with this versus the Pennzoil. A lot of people, they say Pennzoil is very close and this and that. And Actually, it's not close at all. This is 100% synthetic, and it's good for 25,000 miles, and we actually have oil analysis on that. Check that out up in the corner, and check out that cold flow video, which is really good. So uh, yeah, we're just gonna give a good crazy tall pour. Let that liquid gold flow. Woof. It's so good, you can even feel the protection. <laughs> yep. Tag teaming. Teamwork. <laughs> Beautiful. Hey, if you're new to the channel, definitely subscribe. Tap that notification bell. 
That way you can come back and watch lots of more liquid gold videos. We're protecting your vehicle so your vehicle runs longer and stronger. All right, we got our 9.8 quarts of liquid gold in. It's time to motor her up. Let's do it. Ish's driving impressions. We'll see what he thinks. So he's got very low mileage on this thing. Only 35,000. Basically a brand new car. And uh, I'm stoked. He, uh, he swooped in and grabbed a really nice special edition. He was telling us the whole story about it. It was a great story. And he's waited years to get a Corvette. He wanted to get one. And um, he just wasn't going to settle. And now he's got the best edition that they ever made for the uh, I think Hertz rental car. So yeah. Man, the supercharger, it almost doesn't feel supercharged. No, it doesn't. This is the best supercharger I've ever driven out of any car. So, so far for driving at a quarter of a block, what does it feel like difference? It seems like it's really smooth. Wow. Yeah, it's, it's, it's just really smooth. Wow. Still noisy. Yeah. As far as the so the exhaust, <laughs> sure, the exhaust yeah. yeah, the exhaust, you can hear. Man, yeah, those tires are just grip monsters. Just got some fresh tires on her. Yep. <laughs> Some nice soft rubbers. Beautiful. So where are you guys headed to later today? Got a show to catch. Oh, dinner right. with nice. the wife. Nice. And uh, got a couple of my errands to run before we get back home. So I like it. What type of show? Actually, we're going to see uh, Murray tonight. Oh, he's today. great. Yeah, Murray. He's a good magician. Yeah, That's he's a, funny. He's at 4 o'clock, yeah. If you didn't see my other YouTube channel, Las Vegas Magic Friends, I'll stick it up here. We do all kinds of juggling, entertainment, comedy, <laughs> dirty jokes. We got so much entertainment there, and uh, check that out. It's always fun. And that's what you do in Vegas. You go yeah. see shows, eat, yep. and drive. Yep, that's it. The roads are beautiful here. Smooth. Yeah, it's like a dream. <laughs> However, the lights are very long. Yeah, they are pretty <laughs> pretty long. We're here on, um, we're on Rainbow in Sahara. And it is uh, 150. It is pretty nice out. It's like 52 degrees out. So we got a good, a good winter day for Vegas. Not too cold, not too windy. And this car loves the cold air. Cold. Hey, and if you're new to the channel, definitely subscribe. the upper rings so it runs even smoother and that actually uh, keeps from ethanol separation ethanol gas and water all separates over time so when you run the upper cylinder lubricant you don't have to worry about that all right so he's driving now and really feeling it Let's 
see we're gonna do a little u-turn we got some good blacktop here got some good blacktop let's see what he thinks get some driving impressions so smooth it feels awesome i can't believe that's a blower on this that doesn't feel like a supercharger it just doesn't this is the best supercharged car i've ever been in so far yeah, right, right here we're good so we'll do some closing notes all right we're going around the block in the c7 z06 first time driving one driven a lot of z06s but it'll be neat to see how she feels It's OEM fluid, isn't it? Is, is it? The OEM ETF fluid shifted really good. Um, yeah, Danny had some. Uh, he had some uh, older fluid. You'll see the video with the C7 with Dan and Dan the man. He's in the Corvette club, and uh, his shifted a lot better after doing the ATF fluid. But before, he had a lot of clunking from park reverse drive with the trans. So, uh, but this thing shifts amazing, and uh, this is this is one of the best. Um, supercharged cars I've ever driven. The ones I've always driven, they've always had a lot of lag to them or they had belt slippage and all these different things. But I think this car, they solved all those problems. Um, but I think in the beginning they had a little um, heat soaking or something. So we'll do a little... Steering feels just like the other Corvette I drove, very sensitive, uh, very pinpointed, and uh, they're still the best driving cars I've ever driven out of any production car. Um, the best one is the, uh, I like the C6 Corvette a lot. Um, the C7 I still like a lot. Um, the 458 Italia is one of the best ones I've ever driven, but you don't have the 50-50 weight distribution, you lose that. So. When you have the rear engine, yeah, it accelerates a little quicker, but you lose some of the turn-in, which I like on the Corvette. I like the 50-50 weight distribution, but yeah, this car feels great. It feels so good. Brakes feel good. Steering feels good. Amazing. All right, it's that time for our upper cylinder lubricant, I promised. This right here puts a film on the upper rings that doesn't get lubricant from the crankcase motor oil helps fight ethanol separation and it helps maintain those injectors so they stay clean all you do is just pop it in just push to the side it's sealed really good so it doesn't leak and then all we do is come here and do the double penetration shove in tip first and go all the way in a gulpa 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 and you put this in every full tank of gas and this will actually get you better gas mileage than what it actually costs. It'll save you more money and fuel than what it costs. And you'll go usually around eight to 30 more miles per full tank, depending on your car. Um, we've had cars get up to four miles per gallon better on a Toyota Tacoma with this one. So I think he was going an extra 60, 70 miles per full tank, which is kind of hard to believe, but he was towing a trailer and he had OEM Toyota oil. So there's a little difference with that. But with AMS oiled car, you're gonna get about eight to 25 more miles per full tank with this bottle in, and then your whole fuel system's gonna last longer. All right, Ish, tell them what you think of her. How does she feel? So I didn't think that an oil change can make that much of a difference, but it does. The car runs much smoother and quieter at a higher RPM, and I'm quite shocked. Awesome, you're the best for doing it. Happy. Thank you. And yep. it, it took him, he ordered this oil how many months ago? <laughs> Seven months ago, eight months ago. So we're at the coffee shop, he orders this oil, and I go, when we put this in, he's going to go, shit, I wish I would have put this in how many months? <laughs> Seven months ago. <laughs> but yeah, it means the world for him to come over, and this is the first Z06 I've ever driven of the supercharged model, and I got to give it a good, I got to give it a 9 out of 10. It's that good, and uh, 
definitely check out everything we did on Dan's car here. And um, uh, remember, if you're new, subscribe. And uh, remember, if you want your car to run longer and stay longer, you want to put this stuff in your car. If you want to try the products, click down in the description section below. You'll see all my links. And if you use my link, I'll be your Amsoil dealer. I can always answer all your questions on the products. Always help you with it. And uh, you're the best. Thank you. All right. You're the best. All right. He's going to enjoy this car for many more years to come. We'll see you back next time right here on Synthetic Oil Protection. Cheers to protection, protection, protection.